部。No, I mean, I totally support the whole thing. I just don't see the need for it personally. Well, I'm just saying you might as well do it. It's like a get out of jail free card. You can get pulled over by the CHP with five pounds in your trunk and they can't say shit. They gotta just let you go. I wouldn't count on it. I don't understand why any girl would get her weed card. I thought all girls got their drugs for free just by flirting with drug dealers like I do. You still get your weed from a dealer? No, 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 that's cool. Hey, can I go with you next time you score, or will I have to wait in the car down the street? Seriously, for 30 bucks, why not get a peace of mind? What's 30 bucks? The weed car, fool. What's the last time you saw LA Weekly? <laughs> they got a whole page dedicated to doctors, weed stores, all kinds of shit. Nuh-uh, dog. They got a whole chapter for that shit. Look, here it is. New patients, $30. Renewals, 25 Wow, that is super cheap. Chunky would be heartbroken. Who's Chunky? Chunky? Chunky's my pot dealer. I get weed from him. Only problem is he lives in Glendale. If you get your weed card, you can hook right across the street. Yeah, but I would feel so bad doing that. The weed stores are like the Home Depot putting the mom and pop hardware stores out of business. One day there's going to be some giant store that sells everything owned by some evil corporation. It's going to be all cold with dispensary robots there. Chunky's got heart, man. He tells me about the glory days when he used to sell four pounds of weed a week. His place smells like a musty old antique shop that no one's been to in years. He always gets so happy when I come to see him. And these weed stores are killing his business. Sounds like my Uncle Conrad. 2008, he bought a Quiznos. Two months later, they opened a subway across the way. My grandparents bought an old Winchell's Donuts and changed the sign to say Win Ill's Donuts. Said it sounded more Korean. Ah! Love and peace. And I am glad to see you boys are here on time. We had to get there before 3 to qualify for the early bird special. Going to Caro's, are we? No, I told you, we're going to get renewed. We're going to the MDR PDR CPG Collective. They have everything the medical cannabis user could ever need. True speed, yo. They call them the Walmart of weed stores. It's pretty impressive. They have doctor evaluations, a collective with hundreds of strains, waxes, full melt hash, a huge selection of clones so you can grow your own if you want to. A vapor lounge, a gift store, a snack bar that has boba. I got a henna tattoo the last time I went in there. The Walmart of weed stores? That's terrible! That's exactly what I was just talking about. If you do come with us, that'll make three referrals and I'll qualify for the three gram of dark matter. No way. Dark matter is weed soaked in hash oil and speckled with key crystals. Where is that place anyways? Uh, it's off the 405. It's that place with the three little pigs smoking on the bong that looks like a wolf. If you want things to change, you have to take action, Nikki. I got it covered. I got a quarter of Kush at home. You'd be amazed what I still get for one drunken hand job three years ago. <laughs> That's just wrong, Nikki. Boys? Yeah. Peace out!